Hey there everybody, I'm John Benderwaffles Aljets and welcome to my first video of 2024. Now you're probably sitting there going, John, didn't you only put out like seven videos last year? Why should we be all that excited about this being the first video of the year? For all we know, this could be your only video of the year. Well, here's the thing. I'm gonna be trying a lot harder in 2024. I'm gonna be trying to produce more content. That is a major goal for me. So, because that is a major goal, I want to put out this video to explain to you what I have planned for this year. Now, the thing is, is you guys don't tend to actually watch my, like, sort of status update videos that I do. So, there's a speed development going on over my shoulder. Uh, it's pro it's an older one. It's one that I've released before because I sadly did not have time to do a new one. But it is one that's never been released, like, on its own in a standalone form. So... Check that out, I believe it's from one of my critical developments. I haven't actually chosen it as of the recording of this video. But anyways, let's go over what it is that I wanna do in 2024. What are my big content goals and sort of what can you guys expect? Well, the big thing is, of course, tutorials. Tutorials are what I am known for and I'm not I'm not really gonna get away from that. We're still gonna be teaching you guys how to do things. The first tutorial series that is gonna be up for the year and something that I am actually actively working on right now and should have the first episodes for released within the next few weeks would be the Doom Mapping tutorial series. I'm gonna teach you how to use Ultimate Doom Builder to create three-dimensional levels for the, you know, for Doom Engine games. Stuff like Doom, Doom 2, Strife, Hexen. These are all things that use that engine. And we're gonna we're gonna learn you up how to do it. You've seen some speed developments from me using it. So we're just gonna we're gonna go over it and it's gonna be a shorter series. Right now I only have it clocked out for about six or seven episodes. So that'll be quick to get through. And then we can move on to the next thing that I'm gonna do, which is going to be RPG Maker Revisit It. Yep. Now, all of my old RPG Maker videos are still pretty relevant, assuming you're not using Unite, that is. Uh, if you're if you're using MZ, which is the most recent of the traditional RPG makers, uh, you can you can definitely do all right with that. But they're pretty old, and there have been some things that I have learned, like ways to do them better, and I want to sort of, you know, get those out there to you guys. So we're going to redo the entire series from beginning to end with more information, better information. We're going to go through and it's going to be great. The videos themselves are just going to be way better. Full update of the entire series. I don't know how long that's going to be. I only just started scripting that all out. Uh, that might be a little ways down the line, but it will be coming. But as soon as that is over, we will immediately launch into Pokemon Ascension. Now, this is sort of why I wanted to revisit the RPG Maker series, because to me, the RPG Maker tutorial series is the, the, the fundamentals of not just how to use the program, but the fundamentals of a lot of the design aspects that I'm going to be talking about and building upon for Pokemon Essentials. So that is going to be another tutorial series that will come immediately after RPG Maker Revisited. So keep an eye out for that. There's going to be a lot of great content for that. And with that will also come a whole new new tile set. And this one will be bespoke. It'll be custom. It'll be one that I made myself uh, and it'll be interiors and exteriors. So that'll be a good time. And with the Pokemon Essential tutorial series, we are actually going to be making a game alongside each other as that tutorial series is coming along and it will be released when the final episode comes out. So you'll be able to play a Pokemon game, you'll get a Pokemon tile set, and you'll get a tutorial series on how to make your own Pokemon game. It'll be fantastic. Everyone's going to be having a great time. Now, speaking of making games, another series that I'm going to launch, I'm looking to launch this starting in about spring, is we as a community are going to work together to build a tabletop role-playing game. Not supplements for one that already exists, a fresh one ourselves because this is something that I've always wanted to do and I'm starting to get to the point where I think I'm ready. I have spent a lot of time over the last couple of months looking into a lot of like independent tabletop role-playing games. This is Cairn. It's fantastic. It's a great little rules light game. Uh, we have White Box here, which is sort of a... Uh, Sort of a redo of uh, the original release of Dungeons and Dragons, the the white box release, and then of course Shadow Dark, which <laughs> I love this game so much. This is actually this is the game that inspired me to finally pull the trigger and 
uh, it is time to do that. It's going to be a video series that we're going to be doing together. Uh, we're going to be going through it step by step. We're going to do play testing together. It is going to be great. I think that it's going to be nothing short of a fantastic time. But to fill in a lot of the empty space between those series, because a lot of those are like that stuff that's going to take a ton of effort and a ton of planning and a lot of community input. We're also going to be filling in some of the gaps and doing, you know, sort of fun stuff by doing a lot of the game reviews. I have done game reviews in the past with the quickie reviews and stuff like that. And quickie reviews are going to return. That's going to be something that I'm going to do more of. But I also want to do some longer form reviews, some more in-depth things, looking at games that I love and games that I love to hate and just really diving into them. So... Uh, there's going to be a lot of great content coming down the pipeline. And uh, just so you know, my current schedule, my planned out schedule is one video a week every Saturday. Obviously, that is subject to change if something comes up, if something gets in my way. I'm going to try to build up a backlog so that I can have stuff coming out in case I like get sick or something of that nature or something, a major work thing comes up. For instance, work is going to be sending me to uh, the Sundance Film Festival here in a couple of weeks. Uh, and so I'll be away from home and not making videos during that time. But I'm hoping that I'll have something already on deck for that. I should if all my planning goes as it should be. But yeah, it's just, it's going to be a great time. So look for that every Saturday. There will be a video out. I'm going to be also spending a lot more time in the Discord uh, talking to folks, having a good time, answering your questions, asking you all questions, putting out polls, that whole thing. There's also going to be a lot more effort put into stuff like TikTok and Instagram and YouTube shorts and all that sort of stuff. So you can definitely look for that. I want to make 2024 the year of Bender Waffles as a channel. It's going to be the same stuff. It's going to be the same great stuff and heck, even better stuff. I'm really hoping that this year is going to go a lot better for me. Um, and I hope that you all will be along for the ride. Anyways, that is all that I really have to say. If you have any questions. Oh, wait, no, wait. There's one more thing. There's one more thing. Uh, I'm going to try my best every Sunday, at least whenever I possibly can. Every Sunday, I'm going to live stream both on Twitch and YouTube. It's just going to be chill. We're going to maybe play some games, do some development, sit around, ask questions, maybe watch something. I don't know, but I'm going to be, the goal of it is to be talking to chat. That is the, the primary goal. And just to also to have fun. It's just meant to hang out. So Sundays, I don't know when during the day. It'll probably be late afternoon into the early evening Pacific coast time. Uh, so hopefully that works out for you if it doesn't. I, I'm sorry. Uh, we will, maybe I'll try different times to see who can show up when, but anyways, that is also another plan that I have. Uh, but that's all that I have for this video. If you like this video, give it a like, uh, don't forget to subscribe. I think only like, I think it's something like 18% of people who watch my videos are subscribed, which is that's, that's depressingly low. Uh, so maybe we should, maybe we should change that. <laughs> Although I make tutorials, so maybe I should expect that people don't, you know, usually subscribe to tutorial channels, but that's fine. Anyways. Uh, so if you like this video, like it, subscribe, all that good stuff, follow me on all of the things. Uh, and I hope that you have a fantastic rest of your day and, uh, see you next time.